Hello traders, welcome to the first edition of Looking Forward with RRG. This recording is made at 8.30 in the morning on the 11th of March. My name is Trevor Neal, I'm a technical analyst with my colleague Julius de Campanar at RRG Research BV. Now we will start as we will always will do by looking at the relative ro rotation graphs of the indices the major global indices versus the MSCI world. So here we have in this quadrant here, we've got a very, very clear message. We've got the Russell 2000 here, over here, in this leading quadrant, the S&P in the leading quadrant, the Dow Jones Industrial Average in the leading quadrant, and all of them pointing in a northeasterly direction. And so these are all looking good, if you like. And it's outstanding that they're all together, bunched together, this same set of US indices. So here we have the DAX, the stock, stocks, the Hang Seng, uh, the UK, uh, which is coming around. The only one which is in, in uh, this, uh, the right hand side of 100, so is uh, the, the ASX 200 uh, index. But let us say that uh, you want to be in um, stocks, the choice is clear, it should be US stocks. On a relative basis, it's the best performing. So depending on your view of you know, the current situation, whether the stocks will be ready for a rebound, there is a clear message here that the, uh, the best performing uh, one at the moment, uh, likely prospects, is the US uh, market. Now let's look at the S&P and break it, down, break it down into what sectors of the S&P is leading this move. And again, we've got an unusually clear message here. We've got two outstanding, um, these are ETFs of uh, sectors, uh, utilities, and no surprise, energy. Look at the direction of this, northeasterly uh, direction here, improving um, reading of, uh, of a leading security. Uh, we've got the rest of them bunching around uh, the index itself, but here we've got a strong message. So the area to be in, in the US stock market, the S&P in particular, is the energy sector. Now let's go a little bit further down and look into that and see this energy sector as it, how does it look on its own. You can see it's in, on a good uptrend with rising lows uh, pattern here, uh, making a new recent high. We've got the MACD, which I'll bring up here now, which is positive and above its signal line. Um, so this is uh, gaining momentum. The gap is widening. It is strengthening 